why do we need uh, scientific methods? Particular scientific methods from Buddha, Buddha's scientific methods to improve our human nature and quality. So how do we do that? We all want to improve continually and actually if we check we apply a lot of effort to improve continually various kinds of things. What do we try to improve normally and in the main place? Our external conditions. I mean, even maybe if we are Dharma practitioners for many years, we still are working hard to improve our material and external conditions. I mean, there's nothing wrong about it. But our main focus uh, still should be to try to improve our human nature and our uh, human quality. So, human nature means uh, our uh, character, character, character. Yeah, our characteristics. This, this means uh, nature, defining characteristics. Uh, determine a nature. So we can ask ourselves, anyway we need to make ourselves many many questions um, all the time when we are studying and particular in this preface. Okay, so how is my human nature? Is there something to improve? Do I have a human nature? Sorry, more explanation tomorrow. And what are my qualities? Would people say this uh, nature of this person is really good? Good? Has a really, has good qualities, this person. No, just like thinking, trying to think, okay, mm, what is my nature? Angry? Happy? Kind? Not so kind, sometimes. And, and we, we, we check, we investigate, and then we ask ourselves, okay, Mm, maybe there is something to improve. Maybe, maybe not. How or where do I improve my nature, my quality? And Gashila says, in very conclusive, through developing the capacity of our mind. So actually he's in one phrase saying what we are doing afterwards in the whole book. It's always about improving our human nature and our qualities continuously. Continue. You don't do anything else. It's continue improvement. Continue. Okay, so then Geshla wants to explain to us that we need to stop to think that modern technology and development is going to solve our human problems. We need to stop. And I think we, we need to think about what well, Geshe always is inviting us, please contemplate, think about, and then you conclude if what I'm saying is correct, if, if this is what you understand as well. 
if you really start to investigate. And I also can remember when Keshula uh, came to the West, he said, uh, anyway, I came from a very poor country and I thought when I come to the West with so good conditions, people must be just so happy. And it wasn't what you found. Actually, it was the opposite. 